Okay, you know what? We'll take it on. We've got the revolver. Oh god, there's three! There's three in here! There's four! Ow! 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 Wow, that did not go as I expected. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Signalis. Last time we got a flashlight, super duper important, and we generally cleared out uh, kind of the bottom three floors here except for a few areas. We've got a dark room there with a door that wouldn't open until we had light. All the dark rooms have one that we can't open without light. There are puzzle aspects in a few spots, but I don't know what to do with them yet. There is the rolling shutter gate here, and we do have the key for that. That's on 7. There's another dark room there. Island painting. Wait, I did not... I wanted something. And then there was one more dark room... I think off from the cleaning room there. I just never bothered to go into it. We've got... Five shots for our shotgun, two shots for our shotgun, 15 for the pistol. Our health is not great, but not awful. The enemies down there are mostly dealt with, though there's a few we're going to have to stealth around. We're going to start from the bottom. Hopefully those two don't get back up. Okay, we want the second doorway, and then we also want to go down to the bottom as well. Yeah, you guys just stay on the ground. There you go. No enemies for the moment. Replica, oh, we've already read one of these. Wait, is this where we got it from? Oh, yeah, okay, so this one wasn't locked because it was dark. This one was locked because we don't have the eagle key. Okay. That makes sense. Okay, you guys just stay down. I do need to get past you. Thank you. Appreciate your cooperation. What does this need? Hummingbird key. I see. So this room. Okay, no immediate threats. It's gonna be some floor dudes, I totally bet. Oh! Oh shit, okay, I think it reacted to the light. Ooh, and, and a sh okay, there is more than just the one. Hmm. I don't want to have to deal with that riot shield. Uh, maybe if we can take care of the one enemy quickly. They'll stay down while we... Bullshit! That was a shotgun shot! Oh. Well, okay then. That was quick. Hmm. I definitely don't want to have to engage with the shield one. I mean, I guess we're gonna have to, aren't we? If the light triggers them like that, which, yeah, totally makes sense. That shotgun shot, by all rights, should have killed the regular enemy. 
Yo, we've got repair patches? Why have I not healed? We have no cattle prods, which would be useful. Should be good now, right? Come on, really? Can we go back to being blue, please? Damn, okay. Uh, we are pretty full on inventory here, so I think we should honestly use that shutter gate before we do anything else. Which was on B7. Alright, we'll come back to that room, but for now, let's go to 7. And of course, as I climb back down the ladders here... I must do my duty to remind you, if you are not subscribed, please consider doing so. It helps out the channel, and you get to see all sorts of cool stuff as it happens. Okay, so we definitely don't want to engage with you. Which door do we want? We want to go down. Technically, we haven't checked that top right room, but I mean, look at it. Pretty sure we've checked it before anyways. Oh, hi. Ow, yep. You know what? I don't like you. Bullshit! Why are you guys suddenly strong to shock them? I'll just keep this out for now then. How are we doing on health? Not great. Oh, look, another save point. Interesting. And there's the owl key, that helps. Now, which room needed the owl key? Staff dorm on the sixth floor, that's very helpful, thank you. Owl. Biomechanical polyethylene shell. ELUR units are the backbone of the Usin Nation's workforce. These elegant multi-purpose worker units are suited for all kinds of domestic tasks like cleaning, cooking, and simple medical and office work. Eels are highly social and get along well with each other as well as with most other replica models. While unfit for combat, their lightweight frame makes them a prime choice for distant facilities where supplies are limited. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, we'll save. Why not? Okay, is that all that's in here? Yes, I mean, not to imply that, that any of that wasn't important, but just making sure that's it. The piano room. Okay, so we know we can go deal with... You know what, I should maybe do a little bit of healing. We've got a few repair sprays. Just one. There we go. Alright, where do we want to go now? We might as well go hit up that room over there. Are the enemies in here alive? One of them now is. Hi, no thanks. Okay, there's an enemy over there. Oh, there's two enemies. Oh, shit. Okay, how, how, how do we want to do this? Is there anything even in here? I don't see anything over there. Don't see anything over there. I think we're good to just leave. Ugh, there's an enemy over there. Don't give us any floor enemies, please. Island key. Ooh, for the painting. 
Calibri in the management office. One of the Calibris has holed herself up in the management office on the seventh floor. I've seen her and her illusions, sitting inside the room crying. Which one is the real one? I think it's because of that painting in there. Whenever I was close to her, I felt like my mind was being assaulted by the image of that island. The sensation was strong enough to make me hurl. Is there a way to neutralize the transmission? Maybe some sort of feedback loop of the frequency of her control signal. Interesting hint. Venita, Cradle of Humanity. Goodbye. I forgot that we were in a room with enemies. Okay. Might as well go do the island painting now, which means we need to get back past you. How do we want to do that? Do you patrol or are you just going to stand there? Just going to stand there. Alright. Yeah, that's good. Come on. Come on. Ah, you weren't supposed to hit me there. Alright. I need to oh I didn't actually want to heal or save yet. Can I can I can I get out of there? Yes. Continuing without saving. Don't threaten me! I'll save in a second, god damn. Ugh, yeah, okay. Put the keys in. Got lots of keys now. Alright, um, so we've got the island painting, we're gonna do that next. There's the post box. One, one of the keys might be for that. We've also got the owl key, which maybe that door wants. And then there's nothing on that level except our save. These are all old areas we've been. Okay. Heal, please. There we go. Alright, anything else we want to take with us? We need the small padlock key. Oh yeah, and that's on the 6th floor f staff room. Probably that one right there. Okay, now we'll save. Don't threaten me, game. You'll regret this later. You'll regret me later! Okay. We took the key, right? Yes. Thank you for not standing up. Ooh, but you're still up and about. This one then. So sixth floor is definitely next. Okay. 
Looks like maybe I shouldn't have jumped the gun and got, went all the way down to eight right away. Holy crap, hi! Boy, am I glad they can't use doors. If they ever send something that chases me through loading screens, I am screwed. Get, get, your, get your Mr. X out of here. I am dead. Goodbye. Farewell. There will be nowhere to hide. Oh, right. I, I kind of need the key. Okay, well, I guess I gotta run back up to... Number five, real quick. Um, might as well keep the workshop key. I'm gonna store the shotgun for now. It's only got one shot, anyways. We'll save it. And. Where do we need the hunter's key? I guess we'll just remember that we have it. We can come back for it. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to get some shotgun ammo and actually store it. Okay, back down. Alright, what you got, owl key room? Ooh, okay. This place feels mildly safe because of the music, so I hope no enemies jump out of the floor at me, which is my biggest fear in this game so far. I see your inspect. Is it for pickup bowls? It is, okay. Yule and lighter. Portable audio tape player with a knife embedded in the speaker. I see. No space to carry broken music cassette. Can I take the knife? Nice to have a melee weapon, I'm not gonna lie. I guess not. Um. Hmm. That's kind of annoying. And I guess I can go deposit the extras I just got really quick. And then come back for it. That is the problem with limited inventory systems sometimes. Is it just means you end up doing a lot of backtracking back to storage. But that's fine. It's a it's a style. Didn't I get repair kits? Yeah, I did. Get in there. Probably don't need the flashlight right now either, but I, I kind of don't want to give it up, you know? Now that they're throwing darkness at us. Go, let's go! Okay, so now we have that. Where would we even use that? Maybe in the workshop, because we haven't been there yet. Oh, definitely not on the star map or Falk's box. Interesting. So maybe something in the workshop then. Okay, and where are we going... Right, this is where we have to stealth around. I think there's an enemy in the workshop hallway that has been killed and risen once more. But this one's pretty easy to stealth through. In fact, we can almost kind of just run through it, but better safe than sorry. I can't help but feel like that is something. On it. I'm sure I could creep over there again. But that's quite alright for the moment. 
Maybe after I freshly saved. Yeah, okay, an enemy did get back up here. Okay. Replica Known Issues Part 2 Classified Information Commander Eyes Only Previous experience with these replica models has given us insight into irregularities in their behavior that stem from the original neural patterns used for these units. Due to the sensitive nature of this information, this document should be destroyed after reading. Man, they're good at that. Star. Despite their normally laid-back demeanor, stars have a strong internal hierarchy, which is important to take into consideration when promoting units to officers. Not promoting a respected unit or promoting a unit low in status can lead to friction within dorms. Stars will occasionally develop in-group rules involving physical punishments. It is recommended to allow some officers to own military weapons as fetish objects to stabilize their persona. Storch units initially have a short temper. Training them in patience early after deployment is key, as their neural pattern is less stable than other models. Failing to do so may yield an extremely volatile personality prone to cruelty and violence. A common strategy is pairing them closely with an older star unit. Storch's persona stabilizes by showering or bathing. Books on history or mythology work well as fetish objects. Interesting terminology. There's more magnum ammo. I really hope we actually get it soon. That we didn't miss it somewhere. Okay, and then it's just a radio. I need to fix the torn tape inside the cassette before I can play it. Oh. Didn't realize that was a problem. Looping multi-track magnetic audio tape cassette. The tape inside the cassette is worn. Well, where can I? Interesting. We don't have a hummingbird key, we don't have an eagle key, and we don't have that. What did we need for the library? Probably the hunter's key. Okay. So we'll be back. Where we need to go now... We need to go back to one of our storages. Where am I right now? I'm right there. Oh, so I, I can just take the, the lift right here. Yeah, this one. We want to go... Can we go up? Oh, we we're on seven. That's right. No, we cannot go up. Okay. Damn. Yeah, okay, we got a backtrack. Damn. That's unfortunate. You stay down. I haven't been over here yet either. Damn. Yeah, I gotta take you down. I like how they had her place too. So the second we enter. Well, but they gave us a repair patch, so it's totally cool, right? Totally. Auto injector. What do I got going on? 
I got a lot going on. No, I just use it, whatever. This is technically better. Oh my god. How dare you? You sneaky little shit. Firing range. Adhesive tape. Oh, that'll totally fix our thing, won't it? Uh... Damn it. And the fact that you can't just drop something and then pick it back up again. Try shooting. Mouse. Ugh. Well, that didn't do anything. Sixty sixty star. So that same hunter's been practicing. Storch did a little bit and then tank. That's that's neat. What if I hit the really far one? Hmm. There we go. Weapons case. What? A secure storage box for pistol sized firearms locked with a small padlock. What? Oh, it's locked, that's why. Hunter. Oh! The hunter key. That's what that's actually for. And this is shotgun rounds. Shit. Alright, we'll have to come back here too and hope these guys don't heal. Oh, hi, hi, hi. Okay, I have confirmed that that is not something we can even approach. It is not an item. I can stop thinking it's an item. Why did I go in here? Oh, well, this is where I have to use the cassette. No, this is where I got the cassette. Yeah, yeah. Hey, wait, what's this mirror? Did I look at this mirror before? Tall mirror stands in the corner of the room. My reflection. Somehow it feels unfamiliar. Looking at myself for too long makes me feel like I'm staring at a stranger. Interesting. I'm glad I saw that. Mirrors are usually very important. Post box key is what that one's called. Okay. So what did we have to leave behind? There was shotgun shells. And then... Something in another room. First off, let's put that shit away. That shit. There we go. There's the revolver. Okay. A short barrel double action six shot revolver that fires 12 millimeter high power ammo. High recoil, strong knockback. High damage knocks back enemies and shields with ease. I see. And it has six shots to it. That makes sense. Okay, what if we. Because we've got a lot of ammo for that, don't we? Mm, only nine extra. That's fine. Okay, we'll take that out. We'll put the regular handgun in. We'll 
We'll take the shotgun since we are also t uh, grabbing shotgun ammo. And then where else did we... We need to go to the shooting range. We need to go back down to the radio transmitter. I think we got everything down there. Might have been something in the archive, but I don't think so. Then we can't get into either of those yet. Do I have any more keys I'm sitting on? Just the plate of eternity. I wonder if that's something that we're supposed to hold. Like how I kept the photo in my inventory and I feel like that changed something with uh, dude face. What if, uh... You know. What if we need to hold on to that for stuff to happen? I feel like it would be bad something, but that's also a box that Alina left behind, so... Maybe not? Yeah, we need to go back down there. I still have the thing, right? Yeah, okay. Oh, and I don't have a gun equipped. That seems kind of bad. There we go. I don't really want to test it on shields, but I will if I have to. Hope we get a good cycle with you. No, we didn't. Oh, wait, we want to go in there. Don't stand up. Don't stand up. Don't stand up. Thank you. You can stand up when I go back through because it, it literally won't matter past that point. Appreciate you. Oh, it's because I have the flashlight on. That's why they're getting triggered so quick. I forgot about that. Thank you for staying down. Is it when play? Small radio broadcasting unit. Oh, okay. It's set up to broadcast the tapes deck input free signal on frequency 142. I got it. I got it. Uh, I always forget how to use this. 142. What does this do for us? I mean, it's pretty. Is there somewhere that needs audio? Maybe uh, Falk over there? Interesting. Okay. Probably shouldn't leave this playing. Does it... Doesn't seem to attract them any quicker. Okay. That's definitely a good thing. What key does this need? Library key, okay, that that tracks. They trigger quick. Do I have the flashlight on? I didn't. Also oh, there's floor guys here. Yep. Aha!
pick up hummingbird key. Thanks, Falk. Okay, hummingbird key was this one. Messing with any of you. And oh, right, and then there's this room. Uh, what was in here again? Oh, right. Okay, you know what? We'll take it on. We've got the revolver. Oh god, there's three! There's three in here! There's four! Ow! 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 Wow, that did not go as I expected. Do I have any healing on me? I do not. I should maybe go heal. I think I think that is what I am going to go do. And I will be back. Please do not stand up. We're not going to go in there just yet. Hi, please don't stand up. I would like to not die. Generally, uh, as a rule. Now, I did notice the shield get knocked back. However, the fact that there was like four five enemies in that room that was a little much the shotgun might have actually worked better there All right, please tell me I have some healing pair patches auto injector is actually perfect here go ahead and take that there we go Uh, maybe we should take that with us, TBH. And we'll take the stun prod. We'll actually use that. Oh, but we... Okay, we can't have it equipped. I mean, we can. We're just going to have to go without light for a moment. I want to clear up that room. Or at least see what's on the other side of it. Before I invest any more resources. We did unlock the hummingbird door. So hopefully there will be another key in there. Wait, why am I... Yeah, no. Go, go, go down to eight. Eight's genuinely easier to get around right now. currently that could change also what's what's the deal up here again administrator's key okay i knew we needed a key of some kind but i wanted to double check what it was called okay straight down stay down thank you stay down you, we might as well. No, screw it. This room has angered me. The multiple targets at once. Yeah. We need the shotgun here. Did we drop two? It looks like there's two. Ooh, that's helpful. Looks like they're all dropped. Okay. I 
get him? Pretty sure I got them all. One more revolver shot, and we've got an inventory slot back. Ooh, this seems like it was valuable to come here. Maybe. We did spend some resources, and it's really just more resources back. Um, how close am I to a... Ugh, pretty far, of course. Alright, it might be worth making multiple trips as long as things don't get back up. Can I examine this corpse at all? No? Okay. So we need one, two... Ooh, here we go. Stork. Generation 5 combat lead unit. Bullet resistant armor plating, height 240 centimeters. Each cadre of protector security technicians is overseen by a controller unit, the most common of which is the STCR Stork type. One of the tallest replica models, thanks to their extended legs, Storks figuratively and literally keep a constant bird's eye view of any situation, ready to direct and coordinate their assigned security technicians. Their tough, no-nonsense demeanor, though sometimes described as brutal and even cruel, makes them the perfect fit as unwavering sentinels of order. Cool. So we need three inventory slots. We can go put that, that. Honestly, we didn't use either of those, so yeah. Okay, quick run back. No, I will check out the hummingbird room in a minute. Everyone just stay sleeping, okay? Stay sleeping. Wee. Okay, in you go, in you go, in you go. save in case if something gets up on our way back and we die I will be a very sad panda losing progress is the worst okay you know the drill everyone continue taking your nap your compliance had it too good for too long I see everyone in here please continue taking your nap thank you okay Everything has been looted. All is wa right with the world. In this world that is very much so not right. Now, to be honest, I want to go dump all this back into. Yes, I see you. Yes, you are annoying. Your lack of compliance has been noted. Be like these two. Look at how good they are. They've been sleeping for ages. They respect the process. Don't seek to impede it like you do. Hawkeye. You know what? Maybe we leave the snub nose for now. And we'll keep the regular handgun. Free up some inventory space and save that for like more powerful situations like boss fights. Okay, 
now we can finally go investigate the hummingbird room. Thank you. Get looped, bitch. Oh, we're gonna get attacked in here, 100%. Replica Known Issues Part 1. Classified Information, Commander Eyes Only. Previous experience with these replica models has given us insight into irregularities and their behavior. Okay, that's the same. Euler. Eules tend to feel, form large groups and like to sing and dance, as the original neural pattern for this unit was a ballet dancer. Persona degradation can be easily prevented in this unit by making sure they have access to music through tape players or musical instruments. Always place at least one mirror in Yule dorms as they have a strong urge to check their own appearance at regular intervals. Yule's persona destabilizes by keeping a tidy appearance and through regular social interaction. Yules will often organize in groups of roughly 10 units and give each other themed nicknames. That's cute. Arar. Even though they may seem like quiet simpletons, do not underestimate Arar. Aras. While they may not show it, they judge those who are rude or unkind harshly and will quietly share this judgment with the entire cadre. Aras get best get along best with Yules, who tend to be patient and friendly and have a talent for reading Aras' expressionless faces. In many facilities, Aras will construct service tunnels accessible only to them, often under... F okay, so the Aras are the floor dudes often under floors and in walls. Unstable units may retreat into these tunnels. It is not recommended to attempt to retrieve them. Aura personas can be best stabilized by allowing them access to plants to take care of, ideally colorful flowers or trees. Great. Yeah, we're definitely going to be attacked in this room. They're giving us a document about floor dudes. Eagle key, okay. Keep an eye on Adler, he's hiding something from us. There was nothing in his diary, but when I probed his mind, there were memories of a Lester unit working at Sierpinski. Hey, that's us. There's no record of that model of replica ever being deployed here. An order for a single unit for some survey work in the mine was briefly considered, but no new orders were made due to the commander's sickness. Interesting. And what about this painting? Is this not anything special? No? Okay. Colibri. Commando Senate Control Unit Bio Resonance Technology Replica Hummingbird. Type Generation 6 High Tech Bio Resonance Specialist. Marvel of modern technology, the Colibri is the most capable bio resonance unit ever produced. Every protector Furung's Commando's Falk unit is aided by a cadre of Calibri unit ag uh, adjutants, which can amplify her bioresonance signals, as well as produce their own. Despite their diminutive build, oh, is that the, the shrieking mushroom one we saw before? Calibris are one of the most effective protector units, able to directly influence the minds of replicas and gestalts, Extract information non-verbally and communicate among themselves instantly in the full bandwidth of the senses. The Colibri's bioresonance is the closest recreation of a true hive mind. Spooky. Okay, is that all we're getting from this room? Ooh, there's another room. I see. Okay, what items did we get? We got a repair kit that's handy, a stun prod, and the eagle key. Oh, I see. I think 81 is what I saw. Okay. Good to see you again. And they, they don't ever come back. Their body disappears when we leave. Which is very good. I'm expecting floor dudes. 
I'm always expecting floor dudes. Post box key, okay. Um, shoot. You're really gonna do this to me again? And where are we? We're right here. I guess we'll come back for the post box key after we. Ah! Pain. Inventory limits always suck. Ah! Okay. Go use the eagle key. Wow, you let me do a lot of running there. We're going to need to drop the flashlight at some point. What's in here? Oh, lots of stuff. Lester. Ooh, that, is that us? I think that's us. What do I mean, do I think? That's... Yeah, that's 100% us. Uh, land survey ship technician replica magpie generation 5 cosmo pioneer specialist biomechanical with carbon fiber reinforced polyethylene shell and titanium skeleton versatile combat engineer unit primarily designed for orbital service these tough and stoic loners are best suited as specialist sappers and scouts their technical knowledge and combat capabilities make these units true survivalists, especially when, they're icon when in their iconic white and blue heavy combat configuration, which sports bullet-resistant armor plating on their chest and forearms. Since the original neural pattern for this unit was lost with the destruction of the central neural archive on Venita, new Lester units have been produced based on a decommissioned unit from the Penrose program. Interesting. That might explain why we have memories that aren't ours. Adler's Diary. Oh, that's long. I've been fascinated by a peculiar piece of furniture I discovered in storage. A strange box with a removable dial in the front that was confiscated from a worker some time ago. I was instantly drawn to it, though I'm not sure why. When I put my ear on the mechanism, I can hear it faintly clicking like a clock. Without Calibri's help, it has become much harder to coordinate the logistics cadre. If there is anything good to say about that woman, it is how she knows how to make others respect her orders, despite her minuscule stature. I went to see her today, but her room is still locked. I had a dream tonight. Another memory of my gestalt life, I believe. I was wearing my uniform. There was a young woman, her hair white as snow, and I was conducting some sort of test. White-haired woman again. I had a deck of cards with astronomical symbols on them, and asked her to guess the planet on the card I was holding. I was playing with that mechanical lockbox again. I'm pretty sure, I, I'm not sure I'm fully reading the date right, but I think years have passed here. Of which I am now sure, or at least months for sure. Of which I am now sure is some kind of astronomical calendar, when I suddenly remembered a conversation I had with another replica when I was inspecting the mining site. However, it was clearly a model I have never seen before, some type of engineer with an orange chess piece. In my memory, she was just another member of our staff, but no such replica was ever stationed on Sierpinski. Replica memory is not the most reliable, they say, but never before have I experienced such a strange phenomenon. Wonder if we're tapping into multiverse? The little enigma of that box could only distract me from the chaos around me for so long. All the box contained was a small notebook, of which all pages turned out to be blank. It has been miserable since our beloved commander has fallen ill. I long for her stern guidance, that overwhelming authority in which she bathes the room. More sick, making my work ever harder. How are we meant to shoulder this workload with no reinforcements? My only consolation is that as our protector staff decreases, so does the workforce we oversee. While more and more replica end up in the hospital wing, Gestalt workers seem to succumb much too fast for any attempts at treatment. Another diary filled for no benefit but my own satisfaction. I've not ordered a new one yet, since I spent my saved ration marks on that marvelous looking fountain pen, but I guess I'll make use of that notebook. The notebook that was in a box that was apparently ticking.
There's a hole in the front of the box. Looks like something is missing from the mechanism. I see. Is that it in this room? Yeah, there's our file. Got a little bit of room again. Maybe we'll do this. Okay. This is not the room that had stuff in it. Was it? No. Right, it was this one. Yeah, I see the body's gone. There's the post box, key, and ammo. No loot left behind, damn it. Alright, now we are going to go... Back upstairs. Yeah, now you stay down. Okay, yep. The balance was broken. Ooh. Ooh. Rested so long, you had so much energy left. God damn. Alright, let's open this post box. What you got for me? It was for 512. The library key. Okay. The library was back down on floor 8. Yes. What's left? Pretty sure we've done everything we can on 7. Unless we have to go back to Falk there. We've done everything we can on 6. So it seems like the library... And the mine shaft is all that's left. The mine shaft is the mine is probably our next like major area. So you know what? Let's go check out the library. Ooh. Right. Let me go up one. Deposit our stuff and do a cheeky little save. Um, put the repair kit away. I think we're good to put the flashlight away. Take the shotgun real quick. Put it back in. Maybe since we put the flashlight away, we'll take the revolver with us just in case. Hopefully I don't regret that. I have a feeling we're coming up on a boss soon, so I'm I'm very prepared for the possibility. We might walk into that library and be faced with uh, a big boss fight a la TV face, but... We might not have another boss until the mine... Yeah, yeah. I got used to you being good. Alright, library, what you got for me? Please don't be dark. Oh, good. Oh, hey, there's a living person here. Neat. Ooh, ooh, that's for sure the, the boss, which was Mina. I think we've... TV face. I think we've encountered another document about them. 
Biomechanical with high security reinforced armor plated servo shell. Generation 3 industrial specialist. Mining nuclear tech. High security replica. When it comes to dangerous cargo, heavy, heavy machinery, and hazardous environments, no other model rivals the MNHR units with their high security power armor bodies. Even in lethal radiation, under crushing pressure, and in zero G, they keep their calm demeanor and show exemplary teamwork. Despite their hulking bodies, underneath their face shields a standard Generation 3 cranial construction can be found. Underneath their face shields. Ah. Making maintenance and social interface as easy as with any other replica model. Please note that the MNHR neural pattern is not suited for combat use. For combat applications, the SAPR variant should be used, which employs a combat-capable persona in the same frame. For more information, see Scherer... Schwer Anti-Panzer Replica Schnapper. I see. So which one did we fight? Repair patches, you love to see them. Replica Known Issues Part 4, so we're missing Part 3. Previous... Oh, okay. Uh, Colibri. Great care should be given to Colibris. Their neural patterns are very unstable, and their bioresonance module makes them very susceptible to influence from others. Like most bioresonant individuals, Colibris will often subconsciously create an emotional feedback loop, imitating and then broadcasting the emotions of those around them, acting as a sort of amplifier. While they are trained to recognize and disengage this behavior, already unstable units can sometimes spiral into persona degradation. Due to their bioresonant connection, neural pattern development in Colibris varies less than in other models. The constant exchange of memories and emotions between units of a cadre acts as a safety net that buffers extreme changes. However, once a majority of units in a cadre degrade, they will drag remaining units down with them. Because of this, it is important to decommission Colibri units instantly when they begin to degrade. For persona stabilization, Colibris should have access to a well-stocked library. Ha, I approve. Hi. Who are you? You are not one of our staff. The others, they've changed. We no longer sing in unison. I used to be able to see into their minds. We were as one. Together we guided them all. But now, I can't understand their thoughts anymore. I've never been so alone before. And they're still together, and I am here, outside. And they won't let me in. I cannot stand their song anymore. This is the only place where I don't have to hear them. This is the only place I'm safe. I can't go on like this. I wish I had become like the others, too. At least then, I wouldn't be alone. I hate this. Is that it? Yeah. I'm sorry, hon. I am glad to hear that you're safe, though. This place is probably dampened for, you know, good reading. Quiet reading. If she does go out there, she probably will, like, get dragged down with the rest of them. Okay, what the hell is this? Alignment error use manual controls? I see. Where am I trying to get it to? The blue one, maybe? Oop, not the one I meant to press. that one. Is that what I wanted? I don't think so. What am I doing with this? Obstacle detected. I'm confused. What am I trying to get out of this? 
I like puzzles like this, but I, I don't know what the objective here is. Now we're back to where we started. Um... Is that it? Oh, hi there. Oh, okay, that's just the wire. Seriously, what am I trying to do here? Game? What is my objective? Why can I, like, hit this book? Sometimes it goes into it, sometimes it doesn't. Ah. Oh, that was the king in yellow. That's what that was. An astrolabe. Oh, that's for the, okay, that's for the star map. Goodbye and good luck to you. Which is conveniently right here. Hooray. Maybe it's not? Back of device looks like it. Oh, that goes into, um. The shrine box, yeah. Alright, well, I have to go back that way anyways to save. Might as well. Still don't know what the star map's for, then. Am I holding a gun? I'm not. I would like to be holding a gun. Especially because those two both decided to wake up. I hope I don't, I don't ever need to go back there again. Ow. Is that where I need to go? Oh, it is, and I don't have the flashlight. Alright, that's fine. We'll do that next episode. I already kind of pushed this one a little bit more forward. So let's get in here. Take I guess we'll take some repair patches and heal until we're full. The fact that it's over time gets me. Is that over time in inventory or only out of inventory? Because I've seen it change to blue. But I can't tell if that's because the effects. See, so like, boom, it just changed to blue. Whatever. Okay, what else do we have? We got the two pistols, we got that. I'm good to keep it that way. All right, and with that said, this is where we are going to leave it off for today. So thank you to everyone for joining me. I hope you had fun, and I will see you all next time for some more Signalis.